All right, what we're talking about here is how our air barrier is continuous from our foundation wall up through our floor system. Uh, the first thing that we're looking at is how we transfer the air barrier from the foundation wall, the actual concrete being the air barrier, to uh, the mud sill, which is what our floor system or wall system will be sitting on. Uh, we're going to apply two continuous beads, which that is the secret in this, is that these beads are continuous of big stretch sealant. Uh, this sealant has a bit of elasticity that will allow the uh, air barrier to be continuous as materials expand and contract throughout the seasons. The surface of the concrete is a bit uneven. This sealant also helps make that seal between the concrete and the mud seal. The second step is putting down what's called a seal sealer. This is pretty standard in construction, but this is the capillary break from a moisture, uh, a high moisture content foundation wall to our wood framing. We don't want our wood to absorb any more moisture than it needs to. The last step before we put the plate on is to make sure we get the big stretch around each bolt and then as well as stretching it through to the next bolt.